Sanko AP Physics Experiment Number 9, Static Equilibrium. Students use a model of a ladder to determine the coefficient of friction necessary to keep the ladder in static equilibrium. This lab teaches first and second conditions of static equilibrium and how to determine the coefficient of friction. Students are required to analyze and validate their experimental results. They must write a persuasive essay to support their results. The kit includes a hinge board with multiple hooks, a friction board with four different surfaces, friction block, protractor, and two pieces of aluminum flashing. Required but not included are a triple beam balance, hooked masses, and a force probe. The first part of this experiment that students can do is lean a ladder against a wall, which has hooks at different positions so you can hang masses at different points and thereby changing the center of mass of this ladder. What the students want to do then is lean this against the wall so that's touching aluminum flashing on the bottom and aluminum flashing on the side using free body diagrams and equilibrium equations to determine what's the minimal force of friction needed to keep this ladder stationary. It's a great way to introduce free body diagrams and also torque. Once the students have gotten a grasp of using free body diagrams and equilibrium equations to determine the force to keep the stationary, you can then change it up on them by using a friction board that has four different surfaces and have them extend their knowledge to how does this whole system change if you change the type of texture that the surface is in contact with. 